Like that's why I always respected about the English, the way you guys raise your kids. I mean, like, uh, I know that none of your dreams will ever come true. The sun will never shine on you. Uh, life will be terrible. Get back in the mine. Right, that's great. <laughs> you set that kid up to win, and I like that. I also, for as long as I lived over here, wish I could do a better English accent. And I can't, can't breathe very well. That's right. <laughs> I have asthma. That's really all I got. I can do that accent on my old 85-year-old neighbor Janet's accent. It's two very specific English accents. Luke, would you help me hang me curtains? I can't pay you in pounds too. I can get you a nice tea and Vicky. <laughs> like, yeah, Janet, I'll help you hang the curtains. I'd always like to mess with her. I'd be like, Janet, that garden's looking good, but the most beautiful flower out there, that's you. Oh, you're so charming. <laughs> Like, Janet, what is that beautiful dress? What is that, like a luon? How oh, is this old thing? <laughs> well, this material's really nice, and then I put my hand on her back, but then I'd like clasp the zipper with my thumb and my finger like this, right? <laughs> and then I'd slowly start to unzip it, right? And I'd leave my hand <laughs> down at the small of her back right there. It's like, oh, you're so cheeky. <laughs> and then I'd take my other hand around the back of her knees, and I'd scoop her up close to my body, right? Real strong. Come. Oh, very strong. <laughs> I feel your body throbbing against me. And then I'd carry her back around the back of the garden shed where I had a blanket laid out all sneaky like with some candles. And like, so I'm in the middle of the day. And I was like, Dan, at any time's the right time for you, baby. <laughs> and then I start bringing her slowly to the ground as I nuzzle her thigh and I put my nose in her neck, just kissing around her ear like that. She's like, I can feel parts of me plumbing. I ain't no mood for you. And she was right, she was very wet, and I was bringing it up. Don't you make that face. Janet is a woman of flesh and blood, and just because she was born well before you doesn't mean she doesn't deserve to get that thing taken care of. You understand? She is a woman who works hard and deserves to get pounded hard. You understand what I'm saying? You ain't better than her, young lady. She's like, just because I'm an old lady. Don't you dare take it easy on me. I want you to ravage my body like your grandfather did the beaches of North. Like Janet, I ain't hold back on you. You're getting thunder and lightning. <laughs> She's like, but just so we're clear, this is strictly a physical arrangement. I don't want you getting any emotional involvement in this. I don't want any sort of relationship. I like to have my options open. You know, it's like, yeah, Janet, I get that. But uh, is there any reason we can't come together, mind, body, and soul, just for this little moment here and become, just make love, just the two of us become one? Why do you always have to make it weird? <laughs> Why can't you just hit it and quit it like a man? <laughs> Anyway, that's Janet there. Uh, 